Welcome back my friends to another reaction video. I hope you're having a good day and if you're not, I hope it gets better. This video is from Vigilante Camp. Let's see what it's all about. Let's go. On March 10th, 2023, cops in Illinois turn on their lights and conduct a nighttime traffic stop. Two officers approach a parked car sitting in the driveway without its lights on. Their first step is to check the male driver's ID. But the cops quickly zero in on a bigger issue. They're going to need to search the car to confirm their suspicions. When officers ask the man to step out of the car, things don't go as planned. Hey guys, officer, you roll the window down? Hey, you know why I stopped you? Uh, no sir, but I live here. You don't have any lights on? Because I was pulling in my driveway, sir. No, you didn't have them when you came out of the heights. That's why I turned the vehicle around. Oh, I apologize about that, sir. Okay, got that driver's last proof insurance handy? Uh, thank you. How much did you got in the vehicle? None, sir. We smelt it all already. Okay. What was that you just put down in that bag, then? Uh, my sandwich, my vape juice, uh, a hand thing because I went to the doctor earlier. Okay. Phone, my battery. I'm smelling for I'm not smelling smoke. You can search the car, sir. But I'm in my own driveway, so I don't see what the problem is. And it's not a... It's illegal to it's possess in a vehicle, a motor vehicle, unless it's in the sealed dispensary container. Do you have any that's not in the sealed dispensary container? No. No, okay. sir. Did they give me a return on the license? There we go. You might as well just go inside, honey. No, nope, she's going to stay in the car until we're done here. What are you doing? Waking her parents up to get them out here. I don't need them out here. This is my traffic stop. I'm about a block and south of Poplar Street on 22nd. This is good till June 30th, 23. You can have that back. Do you think the fact that you're impaired on marijuana had any effect on your ability to drive and forgetting to turn your headlights on? No, sir. My headlights been on all night. Your headlights were not on, sir. At that point in time, I do apologize, but I must have accidentally flipped the switch. I have a bad hand, sir. All right, why don't you leave everything in the car and step out for me? Let's leave everything in the car, sir. Leave your vape pen in the car. Okay. Let's step back here to the front of my vehicle. No, sir. Uh, do y'all hear what I heard, too? Uh, okay, so let's, let's acknowledge that this dude right here, pretty much to the police officer, he already smoked whatever the police officer was, his, his suspicious, suspicions were, right? He smoked it all, him and the woman that's next to him. And uh, he's not from Earth. Let me tell you why he's not from Earth. Because after he smoked the magic dragon puff puff, he decided that the laws do not apply to him once he parks in his house. After he had the lights on, the police officer said, try to pull him over. You know what I'm saying? And he kept going, parked in his house. To officer, I don't want to see the problem here, sir. I'm, I'm at my house. <laughs> You know, and uh, he's huffing and puffing in the car. I mean, what else do you expect the police officer to be like, uh, we're about to search your car. And then he has a tenacity, uh, tenacity to oink, oink, to wake up the woman's parents so they can come up here and save him. <laughs> I don't know what he's thinking, but ain't nobody going to save this dude right here. And I don't know who that woman is, but she knows what's going on because she's part of it. So, that's a, that, 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 I think this is about to get good, right? What do you think? What do you think? What do you think about this man? Is, you think he's smart for, like, pretending there's nothing wrong because he parked in his house after a traffic stop? <laughs> what? I'm going inside. Yeah. Oh. Ah. I never resist that with the around the body cam. That was absolutely resisting. I didn't the not. definition of it. Watch your body cam and you'll find out, sir. I didn't do a damn thing. I went to walk in my mouth and grab my That arm. is resisting. You grab my arms, dude. Sit over there, take a breath. Are you my parents? I know. How old are you? I'm 13 years old. 
you don't need your parents. You're not gonna. Your parents aren't even coming over here right now. They, I don't care. They don't have anything to do with this traffic stop. Okay. All right, get him. Get up. I'm trying. I'm you injured. You are not trying. Swing your knees up. And get up I'm on injured. Your well, come on. You're not one this, Sam. Let's go. What part of you is in? My hand. What does that have to do with you getting up with your feet? Badass. You don't have the ability to do that. You can walk and drive. You can just get up off the ground. I don't know how my flashlight went. I made a traffic stop on him for no headlights. Smelled cannabis in the vehicle. Asked him to step out and he tried to walk into the house on me. So if you guys would, just we'll handle this and, as it needs to be, but I don't need extra people on my traffic stop. Pardon me? Yeah, he has okay. Burgers, okay. Okay. And, uh, he has asthma. Yes, he shouldn't be vaping and smoking. No. Asperger's. Asperger's. Autism. Okay. All right. But he's probably got autism, so. Okay. How old is he? 26. 26. He's, okay. He's, he's going to be, he doesn't really mean to. Yeah. But he's going to. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So. Okay. I'm going to. What he's doing is beyond, beyond his real control. Okay. 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 I understood. All right. Understood. I'll take that into account. I gotta give it to the dad, you know, or, or I'm sure it's the dad, right? Uh, he's just explaining to the police officers the problem seat that, that the boy got, you know. So I'm the, I appreciate him not trying to get crazy like some other parents are. You better let him go, or I'm going to do this or that. We're gonna get some lawyers and all this and that, you know. So he, he just seems like a, a guy that's like, oh. Why he's doing that? But let me tell you what's wrong with him. You know, like that, that type of parent and stuff like that. Another thing, if he has a bad hand, that boy should not even be driving. Okay, and it, I know, I know, people have disabilities. They can still do certain things. There's vehicles that if a person can, you know, walk or something, so there's vehicles that can still let them drive and all that stuff. You know, I mean, I, I give it all up. Good props for people with disabilities to be able to at least function in the way. In, society that they can with the uh, inventions and all technologies and stuff like that so yeah but if this guy is using his disability to try to get out of a traffic stop knowingly knowing what he's doing and he's not supposed to be doing like smoking that dragon in the car and stuff like that that's on him you know maybe the parents should like take away the keys from him or something hide them and ground them like it seems like he needs that because he should kind of acted like a you know child <laughs> i hate to say it up because supposedly he has a visibility but it's true the right another thing the woman did i just hear her saying she was like 33 years old and needed his her parents what why i don't maybe in her mind she's still a child or something she don't know what's going on she can't grasp reality <laughs> oh Okay, I see that. I just want to say that. But I don't know. What do you think? You know, you think the police officers should, like, go a little bit more lighter on, on the man, you know? Uh, I don't know why he just tried to go in the house. Like, nothing was going on. Maybe it's because of this Billy. I don't know. Maybe I'm just being too beat. <laughs> but that's just the way it is. Things ain't going to change. No, no go to the car, sir. I've got to search the vehicle first, okay? Can you stand over there by your oh, car, please? Yeah. Thank you. Yes. All right, ma'am. So what's going on tonight? I'm having a panic attack. Okay. All right, you can't take your kid, your purse into the house, okay? And leave it in the vehicle for me. Is that where the is? Is that why you're? I have no kids okay. on me. Okay. You don't, you don't have to yell. I'm not yelling at you. I, I don't understand. Right. Do you have some ID on you, hon? Aaron, 26. I got a 27. Or 29 by file. Let me take a search purse real quick. I, Make sure I, there's nothing in here. And I'll get you, let you go to the traffic stop. I have birth control. Okay. I usually just a bottle with me, but okay. I don't have that one. Is that for your panic attack? For my, yes, sir. It's my okay. description. Okay. You're free to go if you want to, ma'am, okay? We'll work it out with him and the rest of it. She's free to go. So. Okay. I did as best I could laying on the ground. 
such a mess in here. Well, I haven't found it. That's the only thing I've got on resisting. You still sell it. You got the arrest. Huh? It's, you it's got still, the arrest. Yeah. It's 200, but I mean, if you're hurt, then it's well before it. It's really warm. If I'm hurt, no, I'm not hurt. I'm fine. I said to sweep his leg because he wouldn't comply. It's up to you. Yeah, you can go ahead and start though. It'll just be a level two. Driver's seat. Yeah. There's the tank right there with. I know, it's smelling fresh. Secure 15. Look, man. I gotta say something real quick. Watching these police officers go through the car like that, it makes me want to be there so I can be like, you know what? I gotta help these people clean, man. I'm not the cleanest person, to be honest, you know? Sometimes I gotta clean and I forget because I gotta do like content or do some work and stuff like that. And they see the day, you know, they go by fast and I'm like, ah, I forgot to sweep. I forgot to, you know, but I start getting a little bag and start like they stay trying to clean stuff up, right? This car's a mess. I could not be driving in a car like that. Oh no! But then that's all I want to say to be honest with you. Oh, but yeah. Imagine getting somebody in the car be like, "Oh, just step on that cup. Don't matter. Just it's okay. It's trash." Did you check that bag? You put something down in there. I've got possession of adult use cannabis and resisting is really all I've got on him. Other than no lights from a car. I got half. Yep. <laughs> 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 no, I prefer to go hands on. He should be the only male um, attached. I ran the friend's name. Had the Indiana driver's license. I promise you, I swear I wasn't trying to resist. Well, that, that's. I, I, I that's, felt regret and I threw my face on the ground. I realized that. No, that was when you resisted, when you when you walked away from me and said you were going in your house. That's what the resisting came in. And when I grabbed hold of your arm and you tried to pull away, that's resisting. Auto response. Okay. I, I just, I realized I should have just turned around and said. Yep. Yeah. But when you said I couldn't go in that last time. Oh, does he? And grab for me, I, I realized that, you know. <laughs> Look at the injury. Starting to turn around for it. Gotcha. Okay, fair enough. This is on the tenth. I'll go with uh, three ten. Time to stop. Was... Yeah, you could pick it up tomorrow morning. Be easy, and then you wouldn't get the. It'd just be the straight one fifty because you get the first twenty four hours of storage for free or with the tow. Yeah, 350. Yeah, all the no, just 200 up to the Heron Police Department, and then the balance you'll pay to the Campbell's. Okay. Yeah. okay. Uh, why is it being impounded? It's company pol or department policy. I have no discretion in the matter. Anytime anybody's arrested for possession of adult use cannabis and or resisting arrest, arrest seizure like that, the vehicle's impounded. It, it, no, no, I, I understand. Um, so, even if I hadn't resisted arrest, it would still be impounded just based on the possession of adult use cannabis in a motor vehicle. It's illegal. It's a Class A misdemeanor. So, based upon that, our department policy says that any time anyone's arrested for that, the vehicle will be impounded. Who so had possession of it? It was in the center console. So, whoever, I'm assuming he's going to assume that he had possession of it because he's the one that told me that he'd smoked it. Is he your son? Daughter's boyfriend. Daughter's boyfriend, okay. He lives there. Okay, gotcha. Uh, do you remember what I told you about out here? Yeah, I'm going to, instead of the, the one thing I'm going to do for you, based on that, instead of taking him to county and putting him through all that, I'm going to release him on a notice to appear. And said, Oh, oh, I got, I got to say, that's really nice of this police officer, even though the man acted the way he did. Maybe he's considered that because the, not the father, I thought, because I was wondering why, why he's saying he got a home, parked at home when the girlfriend's, like, now we understand he lives with them and stuff like that. But I guess the, his girlfriend's dad is the one that's asking all these questions about why the car's getting pounded and what he can do to go get it out and stuff like that. So it's actually pretty cool. The police officer, he's going to just release him like that with a, uh, court to appear here yeah, though uh but yeah i think that's it is i think the police officer understands about the disability part since like i said 
the, the girlfriend's dad is explaining to him what's the deal with him, you know? And I'm kind of glad. I like it when people acknowledge that they, they were wrong on the certain things. And that's what we were hearing. That's why the police officer said, it's fair, you know? So let's give us a clap. Yeah, it's, it's good looking good. It's looking Taking good. the old night for the resisting. Oh. Fair enough. I appreciate it. You're welcome. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> it can be a busy street. Yeah, yeah it can. Uh, going through the spiel and you're going to release him to come with me? Yep. Okay. Yep. Sure enough. Are you going to wait on your tow truck? Yeah, I have to. I'm, okay. I, we have to. All right, well, they're here. They're here? Okay. I'll have to get out of their way. Okay. Yes, sir. That's it. Yeah. Oh. I didn't, I didn't How much was in? He just had a roach, and then he had a couple empty containers of. So what uh, was the? Uh, was he can't the, have any in a motor vehicle. Nothing. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. nothing. Yep. Yeah. It's, it's, well, a, it's okay, about but, that long. But in their in their containers. It has to be in the sealed dispensary container. Yeah. You transport it from the dispensary to your yeah. home, smoke it at your yeah. home. You can't have, oh, so have it open. So it's not a, a less than. Or, no, there's nothing like that. Because it wasn't quantity in, at all. specified. Yes, okay. exactly. Right. Okay. A lot of people don't understand that. They, well, marijuana is legal. Well, when they legalize it, they also criminalize it to have it in an open motor vehicle or yeah. open in a motor so vehicle. So it's a roach in some in a container. Yes. Was it? Yeah. How much did you see? Just a little bit. There was not yeah. much left. She said okay. that they'd smoke most of, most of it, which that I believe they did, yeah. but I guess they go to the dispensary regularly and buy it and yeah. smoke it. But you don't let them smoke in the house, she, she said, because you get for your work or something like that. Either outside or away from it. Yeah, yeah. I got you. Yeah. I understand. But that they need to keep it out of the motor yeah, with, vehicle. With the, they they really do it out of, really nice. They don't have to because I can get away from it. It's, it's yeah. secondary. Right, right. And they wanna, can do my blood and all their stuff. Right, exactly. In there, so. Exactly. Oh, right. yeah. You don't care. I'll no, I don't care. Get, uh, yeah, sorry I didn't see that, Larry. I would have, uh, right. If I'd have been looking at that, I didn't dream it was all a little dry. Yes, sir. Can I, like, come up right away and do the two at the police lot? You and, can. And then what's the timeline on getting the car from you? Tomorrow sometime probably be best for me. Yeah. yeah. So tomorrow, anytime, you can come up to PD, anytime. Okay. And, uh, I'll, I'll be in and out all day tomorrow, so just okay. call and I'll, I'll meet okay. you there. Maybe you got you got the keys? Yeah. Okay. Yep. Yeah, yeah just I'm remember gonna, that's all we're going to Okay. I'm going to go ahead. Oh, my God. So from what we found out that led to this situation, you guys, is that uh, the man, the woman, likes smoking that green, right? We we know that for sure. So I kind of I kind of like gotta give it to them, like applaud to them both that they respect the girl's father that he works and he can't be around that or smoke that himself because of work and stuff like that. So they decide to go somewhere else and you know enjoy the green and stuff like that. The only problem is, though, they got to drive back. <laughs> and yeah. You ain't supposed to be smoking, smoking, driving. I'm just saying. And especially, I guess they don't know you can't have. Come on, you guys. Come on. Come on. We've seen a lot of police videos. We Even on in TV shows before the YouTube, you know, like cops and stuff like that. Where they pull people over because they got open containers like drinking or, or other stuff, you know. Come on, it's just that people think they're never gonna get pulled over and get caught or something with it. But I they still gotta like give them respect. They respect the, the, the girl's father to make sure he has a job and all that. Yet, instead of driving and smoky smoky, they could be outside at the back back of the, uh, of the house in the yard smoky smoking too. You know what I'm saying? They don't have to go nowhere else unless they're trying to hide from the father. You know, <laughs> I mean the the girl's father. That's a whole different thing. But uh, yeah, that's a lesson to be learned. You know, maybe the the girl's father would let them be like, you know what, I don't want you to go through that problem again. You ain't even supposed to be driving because you got a problem with your arm. You know, that's a problem right there. That's dangerous stuff right there for other people and the person himself. Since he's complaining about that, that disability with the arm thing too and stuff, he'll allow them to just go in the backyard or in the garage and stuff and do their thing. You know, maybe it'll work out better for everybody. What do you think? <laughs> Yes, 
Yes, sir. Since he mentioned that, I'll go get to Yeah, all right, I know. Uh, otherwise, I, do. All right. <laughs> I know it. All right, no problem. You want to step up here and I'll explain these citations to you, okay? You want to listen to this too, sir? I guess not. All right. So, this is your ID back, okay? There's three citations here, okay? One for no lights when required. It has a court date of April 19th at 9 a.m. Waste County Jail, from Waste County Courthouse. Got one for possession of adult use cannabis in a motor vehicle that has the same court date and the last one's for resisting arrest and that is that it says TB, TBN that means to be notified okay but I can tell you they're going to set it with the with these court date this court date here but they will mail you and let you know that okay and this is your tow sheet it's going to be the level one impound or level two right here and that'll be paid to the police department and then Campbell's is 150 you understand all that Okay, you got any questions for me? You're free to go. I'm just going to sit here and wait for the tow company to come back, okay? Cool. If you want to need to get anything out of the car, you feel free to. Do you have an emergency call? Pardon me, sir? Do you have an emergency call? No, the other guy just went back on patrol. You mean the tow truck? No, he went to get the roll back. Oh. Yeah. So, oh, because it's all-wheel drive. Because it's all-wheel drive, yeah. I set your bag with your hamburger and stuff and your vape pen that you threw under the car by the back porch there it's on the deck right there because the, the car the key's not around here I believe the tow company guy has the keys to it you need a flashlight there's your wallet up on the dash everything else should be in there Back there, if you want. Why don't you go back in where it's warm? All right, guys, have a good night. The man was arrested and charged with criminal trespass to property and with resisting and obstructing a police officer. I gotta say, even though he did all that and stuff, I mean, the police officer ended up being, he got a good police officer. I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna be honest, because I've seen other videos, but they don't really care if you have a disability or not. They still book you. And this police officer released him. So I was like, wow, that's a good, that's a good hearted cop. I mean, when it comes down to business, he has to handle business. We, we seen that, but at the end, he, he does have a good heart. I'm just going to be honest because I, I thought he was still going to take him like, to jail for what he was doing, you know? <sighs> I still with that one girl, though. She said, I'm 30 something yourself. I need my mom and dad or something like that. I was like, what? I, I don't understand that part. But I don't know. Let me know what you thought about this man and, and, and his girlfriend, you know? I mean, it was an interesting video. I, just, I didn't expect the ending. That was a whole different type of ending for me, man. I was thinking like, let's go. But then again, I don't know. Still, thank you for watching. Thank you for time. Hit the like button because it really helps this video and channel on. Because if you hit the like button, YouTube will suggest this video to other people that have not seen this channel or a video before. And I really appreciate it. It's the best way to support this channel. You want to watch another video? You can watch this one right here or the playlist. And I will see you next time. Bye.